hey guys welcome to my channel welcome back to my channel um i am here with another crochet video perfect for springtime i am in love with this hair um this is from trini tresses i'm wearing their river curl in 20 inches i believe in color 1b27 no 1b30 one of those i can't remember off the top of my head but i will put of course everything down below in the description box for you so let's get into it so first things first i have in four packs of hair um i will show you guys towards the end of this video how i installed the hair just a little just a little clip um i normally do my i always do the same braid pattern so nothing is going to be different so i did not add that into the video i always do about 10 or 11 braids going straight back to my head about three fourths of the way and then i bring them all together make an s braid to form just one single braid at the end i started off only splitting the hair about i'm going to work in four so that you'll kind of understand a little bit better um about two four so halfway of my head i did i just split the hair in two it's not going to end up frizzy or anything like that trust me i thought it was going to because i cannot stand not i cannot stand but i'm not the biggest fan of splitting like hair a lot of times but i had to with this hair and it came out really good so half of my head about up to here of course i just split it in two the middle kind of area ish that area <laughs> i split in i split each strand in three and then as i got close to my hairline and baby hairs i split it in four in some some places I was very concerned about this hair giving me frizz having to split it so many times but it did not it actually you'll see in the video every time i did split it i always throw my finger around it and then i crochet it and the hair ended up going back to its natural um that natural curl pattern so i was very happy about that i absolutely absolutely love this hair and i love the color it is perfect for spring oh my goodness love it so did i have any leave out no leave out this time i just of course i never go to like my edges all the way one because i just don't like to it's just personal preference i also did not do any leave out because it wasn't going to look right with this hair you have to be careful whenever you're doing ombre um simply because if your hair is like going past where it you know starts to lighten up you would have just got a big black strip of hair in the front of my head and it just would not have looked natural that's why whenever i do a leave out i'm always going to do it with black hair as far as putting any product or anything in this hair the only thing that i have done thus far is just put like take my spray bottle just water and then just spray the hair lightly and just kind of take away those flyaways and that kind of thing but as far as putting like any like real product in this hair i haven't done it and i still don't think i'm going to do it um but we will see so i've had this hair in my head for about four or five days something like that and it looks really really good i have done everything as far as play with my son roll around on the floor um i haven't even slept like i think last no one of those nights i didn't even sleep like with a scarf or anything on um and it still looks really really great it's really soft and lightweight no it's something about this that just makes me like it's not heavy on my head it feels really good it's soft the hair is soft so and the curls are just really it's, it's effortless it's definitely an effortless style and i think that's why i really really like it i love the the color as well um so yeah so if you are in need of a change look, look at my my nails don't pay attention to that so if you are in need of a change or just want something different for like the springtime or whatever then i would definitely go for this um and step out of if you're used if you're like me and used to just doing black go ahead and step out of your comfort zone girl oh, sorry step out of your comfort zone and do something a little bit different i'm sure this color like not i'm sure i know this color will look great on a lot of people so options for sleeping in this hair at nighttime are very simple i always do one of the two you can either split the hair in half and do two braids just loose braids um going down the side of your head and then tie your hair up or what i've done as well um with this hair is just pull it all back in a tight bun making sure you don't have any knots or tangles or anything like that and just wrapping around pulling it in a tight bun kind of like a big bantu knot bun um and then just tying it with a hair tie and then of course putting your scarf on your silk scarf on at nighttime and you should be good like when i tell you guys that this hair is 
no fuss no anything i mean it i mean it i mean it, i mean it but anyway so if you have made it this far in the video i know i talk a lot and um i'm not sorry about that it's one of the things with youtube if i don't talk enough i don't give out enough information if i talk too much people complain about if i talk too much and you know what i say i don't really care it's my channel um you don't have to listen that's just how i feel about it so yeah so if you have listened to me talk this much then thank you so much for tuning in and i do have a giveaway for you guys which is let me get it trendy tresses was kind enough to send me three extra bags of color just black um, of color 1B in the same river curl that I am wearing for a giveaway for one of my followers. Rules are simple. You must be following me here on YouTube and on Instagram, and you must be following Trini Tresses as well on Instagram. Pick the winner next Friday, um, and I will announce them on my Instagram. All you have to do whenever you've done those three things is just comment at the bottom, I want Trini Tresses, and also put your Instagram name just so that I know it's you. And please make sure you're doing all three things because I do go back and look because I do want someone who has followed the rules, of course, to win the giveaway. So awesome. So anyways, that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will be back very, very soon with more stuff, lots of stuff. I had to take a little mini break because <laughs> it was just stuff was just weird on me. But I'm back and I'm better. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram, of course. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.